Hello everyone, Tina here. I hope you're having a lovely day. Thank you so much for joining me. Today I get to share with you a project for Gerda Steiner Designs and we're using one of the new arrivals over at the Gerda Steiner shop. This is a new stamp set. It's available now. Um, it's called Little Snowman and it is a 3x4 so it's a smaller stamp set but it sure is cute. This little guy has his little hat and his scarf and I just loved coloring him. He was super easy. So we're going to stamp him three times on some Nina 80 pound cardstock with Memento Tuxedo Black ink. And then I'm going to zoom in and play a little bit of music while I color. And when I'm done coloring, I will catch you back. Okay, coloring is just about done. Now um, I'm just adding a little shading with my E79. Ran out of music. <laughs> okay, now we're going to highlight um, our snowman scarf and their little caps with my white gel pen. How I like to highlight is just follow along the image, um, the curve of the image, draw a line, and then add a few little dots um, just for a whimsical look, and it helps brighten up, um, especially when there's a lot of white area. Once this is done, we're going to fussy cut each one of our images out. So using my scissors, I'm just going to separate um, each one of my snowmen. And I'm kind of going to fussy cut in a different way because of the snowbank on the bottom. Um, I want a dimension on my card, and so this is how I'm going to do this. Um, I'm going to fussy cut directly on the bottom snowbank line, and then the rest of the snowman, I'm going to leave a little bit of a white border. And I want to do that to all three of the snowmen. And it's going to kind of look a little funny. And you're probably thinking, what is she doing? But um, it will make sense in just a minute. Now, since the so, uh, stamp set is small, there's no sentiment in here. Um, I'm going to bring in um, some sentiment dies. These are from Simon Says Stamp. Um, there are two different sets. One says sending. The other one says big hugs. And um, I'm going to die cut those out with um, some Nina Desert Storm craft cardstock. And then using my largest stitched rectangle die, we're going to die cut out a black and white panel that measures four inches by five and a quarter. Now everything is die cut. We're going to kind of arrange our little scene. Um, this is going to help with the placement of um, our, our background here. I, and making sure my sentiment fit. I wasn't sure it was going to fit. Okay, once I'm happy with the placement, I'm going to take my pencil and mark just below the snowbank on um, all of my snowmen. This is going to help me with my placement and then also with my stamping. We're going to take the snowman image and stamp stamp the same snowman with memento ink on that white panel and we're stamping the snowbank on the pencil marked snowbank. Um, it's okay if it shows because we can use our pencil to erase it later on. And the bottom two actually worked out good because the snowbank is kind of um, joined together and I thought oh that worked that was a happy accident <laughs> okay now I'm going to take my scissors and I only want um, the bottom portion of this white panel so using my scissors and the very top snowbank underneath the, um, the very top snowman I'm using that as a guide on where to cut once I reach the stamp snowbank I'm going to continue it all the way to the left and right side 
so we're just going to use this piece. We're not going to worry about the top piece. Now to give it a finished clean look, I'm taking my black marker and I'm going to go over it, just continuing that that black snowbank line all across the left and the right, and then also on the bottom of each one of my snowmen. We're going to clean that up as well. Okay, we are going to or kind of arrange our scene, our snowmen. Once they're placed where I want them, um, we can go ahead and glue down our sentiment that says sending big hugs. I thought that the sentiment would go perfect with these little guys because their um, their hands are, are stretched out. Well, technically, I guess snowman's hands are always stretched out, but they look like they're giving big hugs. <laughs> so I just thought the sentiment went really well with it. Okay. Go ahead and add my sending and then we'll add the big and the hugs and I didn't lose the eye in sending which is um, a good thing. <laughs> I added that to it. Okay, um, our back snowman we're going to directly adhere to our black cardstock and then the, the pink and the green snowman we're going to pop up with foam adhesive along with our snowbank here. We'll just place this on the very bottom. And since we die cut this out with the stitched rectangle die, the stitching goes all around the panel, which I think is um, very, very clean looking. I like that look. I added my foam tape behind the panel and we're going to adhere that to an A2 size card base. And you can see it leaves a little bit of a white border. Kind of looks funny, but the stamped image, um, the snowbanks help when you stamp them with white. It just made it flow really nice. I'm erasing my pencil marks and then we'll go ahead and add our snowman. Now I'm adding foam adhesive to the top portion of our snowman and then the very bottom I use my tape runner. This way um, the bottoms adhered to the snowbank that we stamped but the top is um, has a little added dimension and I think that looks so cute. <laughs> Aren't they sweet? I just think they're, looks, they're like little baby snowmen. <laughs> we'll add the pink one. And then we'll go ahead and adhere our orange one directly on that black panel there. Just love those bright colors against that black background. Now I want to add a little sparkle so I'm using my Nouveau Glitter Drops. This is White Blizzard. I added um, a little bit to the pom-poms. Actually pom-poms would have been really cute for the hats on this little um, card here. But I added it um, to the pom-poms of the hats and then added some snowfall with my white, um, simply white glitter drops. And then actually they're not glitter drops, it's just white crystal drops um, for a little added dimension and then a little extra glitter on the snow banks. But that is my card for today, guys, using the little snowman stamp set that's new to the shop. Thanks so much for stopping by. I wish you a lovely day and we will see you again real soon. Bye-bye.